Claudia Maria Schiffer is a German model and actress based in England. She rose to fame in the 1990s as one of the world's most successful models, attaining supermodel status. Born in Rheinberg, Germany, Schiffer is fluent in German, English, and French. Wikipedia Born, August 25, 1970, age 53 years, Rheinberg Spouse, Matthew Vaughn, M. 2002 Height, 1.8 meters Children, Clementine Poppy Devere Drummond, Casper Matthew Devere Drummond Siblings, and Carolyn Schiffer, Andreas Schiffer, Stefan Schiffer Parents, Gudrun Schiffer, Heinz Schiffer Claudia Maria Schiffer is a German model, actress, and fashion designer, based in the United Kingdom. She rose to fame in the 1990s as one of the world's most successful models, cementing her supermodel status. In her early career, she was compared to Bridget Bardot. She has appeared on more than 1,000 magazine covers and holds the record for the model with the most magazine covers, listed in the Guinness Book of World Records. In 2002, Forbes estimated her net worth to be around 55 million US dollars. Claudia Schiffer is a German model, actress, fashion designer, and executive producer. She rose to fame in the early 1990s as one of the world's most successful models, cementing her supermodel status. In her early career, she was compared to Bridget Bardot. She has appeared on more than 1,000 magazine covers and holds the record for the model with the most magazine covers, listed in the Guinness World Records, 2004. As well as endorsing luxury brands, Schiffer has appeared as the face of high street retailers including Mango and Accessorize. Schiffer was a judge on Fashion Fringe in 2011. Schiffer launched her eponymous cashmere collection during Paris Fashion Week in March 2011. The autumn-winter 2011 season saw her fashion design debut and was followed by a spring-summer 2012 collection. Schiffer began her involvement with UNICEF by becoming a member of the Arts and Entertainment Support Committee, and was a UK Goodwill ambassador for the organization. Family Spouse Matthew Vaughn, May 25, 2002 Present, Three Children Children Casper Matthew Schiffer Clementine Poppy Schiffer Cosima Violet Schiffer Parents Heinz Schiffer Gudrun Schiffer. Trademarks. Looks often compared to Bridget Bardot, especially during her early career. Long blonde hair and blue eyes. Trivia. Holds the record for the supermodel with the most magazine covers, gracing over 1,000. Her record is listed in the Guinness Book of World Records. In 1993 she met magician David Copperfield at a Berlin celebrity gala and in January 1994, they became engaged. During this engagement, she sometimes used to appear in his stage shows as a special guest assistant in a number of illusions, first he would levitate her high in the air before making her vanish and reappear, then he would use a large guillotine to behead her, finally, he would saw her in half inside a glass-sided box in what has sometimes been voted by other magicians as one of the most baffling versions of the sawing in half ever performed. Claudia also appeared in David Copperfield, 15 Years of Magic, 1994, a documentary in which she played the role of a reporter interviewing Copperfield in his magic warehouse. After a six-year engagement, in September 1999, they announced their separation. Is fluent in French. She is a spokeswoman for the fight against breast cancer. Moreover, she is a member of UNICEF since 1997 and ambassadress since 2006. She was ranked number 5 in Channel 5's World's Greatest Supermodel. The others are Naomi Campbell, Cindy Crawford, Linda Evangelista, and Christy Turlington. Owns the chain of fashion cafe restaurants with Naomi Campbell, Christy Turlington, and Elle McPherson. Was the first model to wear Victoria's Secret famous million-dollar fantasy bra. 1996 Although she continues to be known as Claudia Schiffer for professional purposes she has, according to papers filed in the UK as part of 2003 legal proceedings against a man accused of stalking her, officially taken her husband's name. As a result, her full legal name is now Claudia Devere Drummond. Her second daughter's name means Decent Violet. 
has a home near Barry Street, Edmonds, Suffolk. In the issue of September 2008 of Vanity Fair magazine, she appeared semi-naked alongside supermodels Naomi Campbell, Cindy Crawford, Linda Evangelista, Stephanie Seymour, and Christy Turlington. The pictorial covered pages 182 through 193. The photo shoot was conducted by Mario Testino, whose career was launched when Evangelista commissioned him to photograph her for the cover of a German issue of Vogue magazine. After being discovered in a Dusseldorf nightclub at the age of 17, she went to Paris and started modeling for Chanel, where she became Karl Lagerfeld's favorite model. June 1992, at the personal request of Sting, she participated in the Rhythm of Life Fashion Charity Gala at London's Grosvenor Hotel to raise money for the Rainforest Foundation alongside the world's top models including Kylie Minogue, Yasmin Lebon, and Naomi Campbell. When she signed up to front the autumn-slash-winter 2006 accessorize advertising campaign, her contract included an additional payment to cover her getting her ears pierced for the first time in her life. She is the firstborn of Gudrun Schiffer, a housewife, and Heinz Schiffer, a lawyer. She has a sister named Anne Carolyn and two brothers named Stefan and Andreas. Their father Heinz died on July 24, 2007. Her first daughter's name means Merciful Poppy. By the end of 2001, she was engaged to producer Matthew Vaughn until marriage in 2002. They had three children, Casper Matthew, born on January 30, 2003, Clementine Poppy, born on November 11, 2004, and Cosima Violet, born on May 14, 2010. During her first pregnancy, she had a craving for curry. Since getting her ears pierced in 2006, her favorite earrings have been a pair of diamond studs, given to her by her husband, presented Prince William of Wales with a polo trophy in 2002. After engagement with magician David Copperfield, she was engaged to Green Shield stamp heir and playboy Tim Jeffries until 2000. She loves Prada and the dogs, especially German shepherds. In 1990 and 1991, she was chosen by People magazine as one of the 50 most beautiful people in the world. Her son's name's Casper Matthew, meaning treasurer, Casper, and, given by God, Matthew. Daughter-in-law of Kathy Sayatun. Quotes. I know one day I'll be considered too old. I think 40-year-old women actually look more healthy and fit than some girls in their 20s. I've met women who have way better bodies in their 40s because they've been working on them for all these years. I actually don't meet very many men because they are, I guess, afraid to approach me or think that I'm from another planet. On turning 30, to the German magazine Stern. On turning down appearing in Playboy in the nude it's not that I'm against nudity. I'm German, I'm very open, in Germany they lay in the park naked. It's just the principle. I always wanted to be less tall. When I was at school, I was the same height as all of my girlfriends, and then suddenly I was turning 12 and almost overnight I got really tall. I became the height I am now from one day to another, and everyone else stayed short. Boys don't want to be seen with a girl that is taller than them. It was totally isolating, because I was different from my friends. I used to work every single day and travel round the world. I worked weekends, I never took one second off. When I met my husband I said, you know what, this is important. I'm not going to work weekends anymore. And when I had kids, I became even more careful. Modeling work is fine, because you can do one day here, two days there, you're never long gone. I love being pregnant. You can do whatever you want. You don't feel guilty, because I used to feel guilty about having a day off. And, you know, something really strange happened to me. Before my pregnancies, I was someone who had to watch their weight. I love wearing flat shoes, but I am not one of those girls who walks around in sweatpants and sneakers. I think I have something going on with shoes. Flat shoes. I buy them in several colors at once. High heels are for work and they have always been uncomfortable for me. I'm amazed when I see mothers wearing high heels. If your kids run off, you can't run after them. I just love to shock people. Yesterday my friend said, what a great top, is it Stella? I said, no, it's mango, 25 pounds. I'm never head to toe in anything. 
I like to mix things from Prada, things from Marc Jacobs, but, you know, you can spend several thousand pounds on something, wear it for one day, and the button falls off. I get really pissed off when you spend so much money. I love my engagement ring. It is the only thing I wear to bed. On finally having her ears pierced, at first, it felt a bit strange to have them done, but I soon got used to it. Now, I really love them and keep wondering why I waited so long to have them done. I'm quite a shy, private person. The new generation, nowadays, they don't have a filter, they can just share and share anything at any moment, and I find it quite hard to share more than just certain things. So if I had to do that in the 90s, I think I would have failed. She has never had a cigarette and she didn't touch so much as a glass of wine until the age of 28, well, that's because I didn't like them. My husband is exactly the same.